Look at the chain, look at the rings, we been grinding. Yeah, yeah. Look at the toy, look at the numbers, they ain't lying. Look at my eye, you see the grind, I cannot hide it, gotta be God. It's gotta be Jesus. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And if you don't mind, go ahead and give me a big thumbs up and drop a comment down below. And also, if you're old, thanks for joining me again. And let's get started with this video. So, you guys haven't been seeing me a lot on YouTube and I am truly sorry for it. But if you want to see my latest things, you can head over to TikTok and check me out. Um, I've been doing a lot of TikTok videos. Mostly I post every other day, sometimes daily. So I decided to bring TikTok over here to YouTube. I've been doing a lot of fashion looks or uh, today's outfit on TikTok and people seem to really love them. So I decided to come over to YouTube and share them with you guys. So today I wanted to share with you guys how to look expensive on a budget. So I decided to pick this outfit and just explain to you guys why I picked it and what makes it look more expensive. So first off, I wanted to start with my jeans. These jeans right here, I don't know if you guys can see them all the way, but I'll try to step back a little bit. These jeans are just some long jeans, and I got these from um, Boohoo, and they were only, I think, $11 or $12. Don't quote me on that, but I will try to put the prices on um, the screen somewhere. So when you're picking your jeans, you want to try to avoid distressing in the jeans. Uh, less is more. A little bit of distressing is fine, but... Uh, no distressing is the best when it comes to this classic expensive look. Next, you want to have a plain shirt, whether white or off-white or uh, nude or black, whatever you go for. But when I look at my shirts, I try to get something with a raised collar. It gives me a more expensive look. Uh, at least it does to me. This is what I'm thinking in my head, but I think it looks nice. Next, you want to put on a blazer. And right now, the longer blazers are in style and bigger blazers. If you're taller, it even looks nice to have on a male blazer. Um, and if you're not, you can go size up from your size so the blazer can be a more fashionable look. But for me, I don't really tend to like the bigger blazers. I go for the longer ones. I think it looks better on me, and that's just what I like. Um, and also, you can scrunch your blazers up to give it a more... A chic look and a distinct look. Also, you want to go for a blazer with nice shoulder pads. That tends to bring the look up a notch also. Next, when you accessorize, you want to have uh, some small earrings where if you want to wear hoops, smaller hoops. You can go smaller than this, but these are my smallest hoops that I own, or you can do studs. Also, with your necklace, I wouldn't wear this necklace. I have a smaller necklace, but I cannot find it. A chain necklace and it's a little shorter than this one if you guys want to see it head to my Instagram and I have pictures of this whole look and you can see how it came together in a photo also with your um, belt you want to go with something very simple but this is a classic simple look and it's in style right now with the double loops and it's very minimal and so it's not saying look at me but it's saying just enough next with your shoes you want to go with pumps either black or nude or sandals and these square toe sandals are really in style right now so these make it look really cute and they're quite easy to walk in they're not too high uh, perfect for if you're really going to work or you're on the go and you still want to look chic next and one of the most important things uh, for that classic expensive look you want to tuck your hair in a sleek bun and um, just keep it very simple minimal baby hairs and not overdoing the baby hair also, if you wanted to, you could do a pop of color on your lip or you could stay nude. For me, I like to stay nude. I really don't like too much color on my lips. Next is your bag. This is a simple and classic look. Very sleek, nothing over the top. It is a Michael Kors bag. And I always say, if you have something a little more expensive to add to that look, it'll bring it over the top and it'll make it more believable. So if you did have a Louis or a Gucci or a Chanel, then they'll make it look more believable and everybody will believe that the pieces are more expensive just by your one uh, expensive statement piece. And if you don't have those, Michael Kors, Coach, or Dooney & Burke would do also because those are still nice brands and top of the line in my eyes. Uh, and if you, even if you don't have that, you can easily find a bag at 
PJ Maxx or Marshall and they look very, very nice and very top of the line. Just make sure you go for a very clean look and that ties the look all together. And that is it for my style tips. If you guys like this type of video, please leave a comment down below. Let me know if you want to see more. And don't forget to go over and follow me on TikTok and Instagram as well. And main thing, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. And I will see you guys in the next one.